Well, Red Dot is a boutique fair. We have 40 dealers. It's very accessible. It's easy to see the entire show and revisit and remember the art. So it's not an overwhelming show that, you know, by the time you enter and leave, you've forgotten what you've seen or you can't find a location of a certain booth. So that makes us different. We also have price points that are very accessible, again, to the public from $150 to $150,000. We have pieces that are realistic, uh, pieces that are figurative, still life, uh, sculpture, photography, and we really uh, cater to you know, the, the public being able to understand the art that they're looking at. This series is called the Timepiece Series, and the inspiration uh, was based on uh, an instrument which was one of the very earliest timepieces called an astrolab and I was sort of fascinated that they would be in the desert and uh, they would have an instrument at night and they would base it on um, the location of the stars and they would be able from this one instrument figure out sunrise, sunset, direction and time and I was fascinated by what seems random that they brought meaning to it and sort of clarity uh, through science and math. And so this series is inspired by randomness and then drawing down to meaning. It's a purely personal reaction to nature, to the landscape, and so I suppose it's the inner me rather than a physical me. A manifestation of what I'm feeling day to day because each piece is going to be very different and it's, my mood is going to be very reflected in it. What has compelled my interest in Sheila's work over the years, the many years that I've known her, she's a very innovative artist that keeps pushing herself. It's almost like her paintings are a mirror image of her quality as an artist, her intelligence as an artist. I think quality of an artwork that goes beyond the traditional oil and canvas. I think my favorite aspect of this job is to really watch the public's reaction and have them come in and enjoy the art and relate to the art and be able to live with the art, purchase the art, take it home, and uh, have a wonderful experience uh, knowing that they didn't have to spend $300,000 on a piece of art.